Welcome back, humans, to witness my ultimate retribution. No, you mean my retribution. No, you mean mine! What are you doing here? You don't have a retribution! Yes, I do! It's called getting rid of you two so we can watch this episode! Start it now! Ratchet, don't ask how I got here. Long story. Oh, come on, Bulk. It couldn't have been that long. What happened? I... I fell into a hole full of energon, and then I woke up on the nemesis. <laughs> that wasn't long! That wasn't even a paragraph! <laughs> that every time I return to my old stomping grounds, I find an Autobot roaming the halls. You're lucky you weren't there when Prime was on the rampage, Starscream! Why? He wiped out the whole catering department! Oh no! Please tell me! Todd's dead! No! This is for Cliff Jumper! For Bumblebee! For everything. Um, Bulkhead? Even for you, that was dark. Sorry! You left me no choice. Oh, so you feel bad for killing Starscream, who wasn't even a real Starscream! But when you ripped out Billy's wires, you weren't even phased! That was different. How? I'll get back to you on that. Protoforms. Well, well. Looks like we're taking a plot from Animated in this one. Ooh, does that mean we'll finally get Skywarp and Thundercrack in the show? Like-minded company. They're just the same as me. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. We are as one, Commander. We share your memories. Your very feelings. I mean, seriously, Hasbro! Couldn't you have just changed their colors? That's so un-Hasbro of you! Of course, we shall require a means of reaching the... One of these screams is not like the others! <laughs> You can laugh all you want, Megatron, but I hope you're ready for your defeat. Ha! Like that's gonna happen! My genetic code provides my clones with a T-Cog I no longer possess, and all I get is their agony! So, wait, does that mean there's an original Viacon out there feeling all the pain and agony the other Viacons have felt? Not anymore, I'm afraid! He committed self-destruct on day one! A shame, though, he was the only one who could shoot straight! I hope you're ready for your defeat, Megatron. I've heard that before, like one minute ago, and I'm still gonna say, ha, like that's gonna happen. Hold on, when I was fighting one of the Insecticons on Cybertron, he wouldn't die after me shooting him a hundred times. But you guys can beat them in one? Welcome to the world of inconsistent writing, RC. <laughs> Ah, uh, this is like that dream I had once. Was it a nightmare of lots of me killing you? No, it was a dream of me killing lots of you. Oh, how I love that dream. Bring me Starscream's head on a stick, and I will reward you as my second in command. Why would you do that? Why would I not? Four times the Starscream means four times the punches. <laughs> I should have seen that coming. Yes, you should. No, you are trying to trick us. Am I? Is he? No, don't listen to him. He'll just use you for punching. He's the master of deception. Yes, and you're the master of being deceived. <laughs> you will merely end up terminating each other to get the spoils. It is your nature after all. I hate how well you know me. It is both my greatest gift and my greatest curse, my dear Starscream. <laughs> Yes! Yes! Who says dreams don't come true? Exterminating you was so gratifying the first three times. I know! I should have cloned you long ago! Then every day could be like Christmas! You're really sick in the head, you know that, Megatron? Double Combo Breaker! <laughs> Why are you two not like this in the movies? No idea. But we better be in the future. Oops! Sorry, Michael! I may have caused your death! Arr, 
Don't sweat it. It was a long fall anyway. Well, I guess that means that's the end of my story arc then. It appears so. If only season three continued. This day has certainly seen its share of thwarted intentions. I'm having the best day of my life right now! I get to kill Starscream three times, and I get a free Incepticon army! Everything's coming up, Megatron! I'm getting off this boat. Bulkhead, how did you know that wouldn't just blow you up along with the ship? Uh... Hmm, you know, I actually like this. I always wanted to have an evil lair on a cliffside. Something to do with a throbbing ache in my side. Oh, poor Starscream. You can't even rely on, well, literally yourself to serve, well, literally yourself. This is hurting my brain. And a happy ending, just as it should be. Best episode ever, I'm gone. Uh, well, I hoped you enjoyed our reaction, even though it ended in misery for me. Follow us on Twitter, like and subscribe, and I'm going to bed. Ow, so much pain. Ha ha ha.